Hello, Center High School. We're the Brown Boys. Later in the show, we have a story about a couple of first-time flyers from Center High School. And, and Clear Connection starts now. Now it's time for the Bulletin for Thursday, April 14, 2016. Today is the testing block schedule for periods 3, 4, 5, and 6. Here's what's in the news. Today is National Reaches High as You Can Day. Today is about reaching high, higher than we think we can. We often become complacent. National Reach as High as You Can Day is just a reminder not to let your dreams go adrift. Reach for them. Reach as high as you can. There's one thing you may not be able to reach very soon. The yearbooks are selling out this year. Get yours now before they are out of reach. If you want your photo used in the Moving Up or Senior Slideshow, please send them to chsmovingup16 at gmail.com. Transform Bible Club is promoting Fellowship of Christian Athletes speaker Tyrone Gross. This Friday in room 116 for first lunch and Mr. Heslin's room 117 for second lunch. Sophomores, Friday is the last day you can submit your link crew applications for the 2016-17 school year. Seniors, your panoramic picture is Monday during advocacy. Wear your class or senior shirt. Picture order forms are available in your English class. Juniors, you have a class meeting in the theater during advocacy on Monday. Pre-order your Krispy Kreme donuts Monday through Wednesday next week to be picked up Friday morning. The price is $10 per dozen. Want to be a part of student government next year? Pick up an election packet in the student center starting Monday. Packets are due Friday, April 22nd. Senior singers, national anthem tryouts for senior awards night and graduation are Friday, April 22nd during, during lunch in the leadership room, 603. The dance production through the library is tonight and tomorrow night at 7 p.m. in the theater. Tickets cost $10. Now it's time for our feature. Student producer Griffey Peters has this story to tell about the first time flyers. For some students on the MCA trip to LA, flying was no big deal. But for some first time flyers, the flight to the trip would end up being one of the biggest parts about it. Am I nervous for the flight? Mm, on a scale of 1 to 10, I'd have to say I'm at like a 7, only because of movies I've seen and shows I've watched and yes I'm scared because what if it like crashes what if, what if I die today um, what are things you've heard of about flying that it's not that bad but I guess I'm gonna have to experience for myself expect it to be like it was in snakes on a plane um, I'm afraid that something's going to fall out and then gas masks are going to have to go on and I, that's what I expect. No, I'm not excited to go on the plane. <laughs> what about the trip? Yes, I'm super excited for the trip. Just not going there and coming back. Items either in those over your feet or kicked cram shoved underneath your feet in front of you. Keep the area around your feet completely clear. Once again, folks. Oh, sorry. I just got off the plane. I went on a plane for the first time in my life. <laughs> Any exciting things happen or cool stuff? Um, no. You got free drinks. I got free drinks. It was an experience. I'm just never, it was so surreal. I didn't think that it was going to happen like that. Um, it was awful. I thought I was going to die. I'm really glad I'm not on it anymore. <laughs> Nothing different, I guess. Really, except I'm not on the ground. Now that the flight was over, and our former first time flyers and the rest of the MCA family could go on and enjoy their trip. Reporting from CTV, I'm Griffey Peters. That's it for our show. Follow us at youtube.com slash careerconnection25, twitter.com slash chsctv, and instagram.com slash chsctv. Have a happy National Reach As High As You Can Day. We're the Brown Boys, and thanks for watching CTV. CTV.